Why does antimatter seem to be extinct? Antimatter is real. And it's, there's nothing really special about it, actually. Um, most people believe antimatter comes from Star Trek, and you can find it on the television show. But in fact, it really does exist. Um, in fact, here at Fermilab and our particle accelerator, we produce antiprotons every 20 seconds. What's weird about it is that there isn't more of it around. The answer could lie in the data collected in another Fermilab experiment called KTEV. This experiment is exploring the decay of a subatomic particle called a kaon, where matter and antimatter are treated differently. These observations may shed some new light on the antimatter mystery. So scientists believe that when the universe began, right after the Big Bang, there were equal amounts of matter and antimatter. And when we look around the universe today, um, we only see clumps of matter. There don't seem to be any big clumps of antimatter. For example, all of us are made of, of matter, protons, neutrons, and electrons, not, uh, not antiprotons and antineutrons. And how the universe got to look this way is one of the fundamental mysteries uh, that science is trying to address. But we're standing inside of a room that we refer to as the cesium iodide blockhouse. This room contains the detector, which is really the heart of this experiment, and it's made up of 3,100 uh, cesium iodide crystals. Cesium iodide is a kind of salt. And when certain kinds of particles hit these crystals, they deposit their energy in the crystal, and the crystal converts that energy into light. And at the back of each of these crystals, we have some electronics which converts that light uh, into a signal that we can eventually read out into a computer. Now comes the exciting part where we begin to look at the data. In a way, we're historians here, looking way back to the very beginning, to the processes that occurred during the Big Bang. Nature has been doing the same thing, following the same physical laws for billions of years. Those laws are what we're after. It's a humbling activity, but it's inspiring that we can do so much.